In the last episode of our series, we were introduced to a spectacular elongated skull from Paracas, Peru. It has been claimed by website Gaia.com that these skulls are 25% larger in volume than normal human skulls. Because Gaia is a website that charges $10 a month to learn more, we suspect that they might be misleading the public in order to make money. Here we will conduct an experiment to see how good humans are at judging volume by eye. You are watching Episode 2 of Citizen Science vs. the Aliens of Peru. Okay, Jackson, tell the good people of the internet what we've got going on here, this little experiment we're going to be doing on them. Now, this is an experiment to see uh, which cup is more full and which one is what has less. Right. So what, what I did, actually, when Jackson wasn't even looking, is I filled these all up with 400 milliliters of water. What is a milliliter? Uh, it's, you made a rough design of it, didn't you? Yeah, a milliliter is a cubic centimeter. So if you imagine a centimeter, a cube made out of a centimeter. Oh. One milliliter is the same as one cubic centimeter. And there are 400 cubic centimeters in each one of these cups. Now, the cups are different shapes, just like these two skulls are different shapes. And human beings are super bad at judging volume. That is how much space something takes up. We're super bad at judging with our eyes. And because of that, conspiracy theorists, they'll look at this and say, oh, it's an alien because it looks bigger than this normal skull. But really it's because they're bad at judging volume with their eyes. That's actually what's going on. So what we did is we f I filled all these with 400 milliliters of water. Then I took 40 milliliters. This is 40 milliliters right here. I took 40 milliliters out of one of them and then I poured that into one of the other ones. So one of these cups is missing 40 milliliters and one of these cups has an extra 40 milliliters. Now just so you know the coloring here has nothing to do with anything. I, I did the coloring afterwards so um, don't use that as a hint. But one of these is missing 40 milliliters, and one of them has too many 40 extra milliliters. But before we do the experiment, Jackson, we've made a mistake. We are trying to teach people stuff on the internet, but we are not dressed up like scientists. When they watch their conspiracy theory shows on TV, all the people are dressed up like scientists. They're usually not scientists, like people like Jaime. He's one of the alien conspiracy guys. He'll be on TV all dressed up in a white lab coat. And wow. He looks all crazy. They don't care that the, the information is given him is bad. They just accept it because he's wearing a white lab coat. What are we doing, Jackson? We need white lab coats. Ooh. Do you have... We should go to Target and buy some, should we? Yeah, we could just buy them anywhere we want. They sell them all over the place. They even sell white lab coats to anyone. You don't need a degree. Nothing. They'll sell you white lab coats at any drugstore. Oh, wow. So, let's go, let's go get our magical science gear on, all right? Three, two, one. What the heck? How did you do that? I think that we might be a little bit, this might be a little bit overkill. What do you think? Yeah, if you ask me, it looks a little overkill. Yeah, let's lose the mask. Yeah. Ow. Maybe that, maybe the head should, should I keep the glasses? Are the glasses cool? The glasses I'm supposed to wear anyway, so... All right. Oops. Eh, they're fine. All right. We are now official scientists. So, all right. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the experiment. I want you to guess which one of these is fuller, which one is less full. And this is number one, two, three, three four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, eight nine. nine. In the YouTube comments, write less equals and then choose your number and then write more equals and then choose your number pretty simple which one is more full which one is less full we're going to find out the answer next week make sure to subscribe to our channel so you catch that when it comes out can you get both right or at least one right or at least one right we'll give you um a B minus. We'll give you a B minus. 
If you get it right, we will give you your prize is the joy of being right on the internet. Should we give them a reward? Jackson wants to give you a free skull from Bone Clones with his allowance. No, I only have one <laughs> buck. Okay. All right. So next week, we will find the answer. Until then. Stay curious. All right. High five. <laughs>